situation. A murder. A body was found this morning by a man taking a dog for a walk. Ha! It's not something I'd like to find in my morning stroll. But it's all part of the job, eh? They always have to invite the media, don't they? Detective, detective! Do you know who or what did this murder? No comment. Do you know what the motives were? Why was this man murdered? No comment. Well, uh, how, how about the incident Sorry. a few months ago? We can't answer any questions at the moment. Uh, please consult us. Next week at our conference. Look at this. He was definitely strangled. The marks are still here. And he has burst blood vessels in his eyes. Any ideas to when the crime was committed? No, sir. Let me ask the scientist. Excuse me. Do you know the time of death? After examining the body, we are fairly certain that the time of death was around 5 a.m. Cooper, come over here. I found something. What is it? All these pieces fit together. They must have been smashed on a hard object, like a skull. Yes, my thoughts exactly. I think we'd better take this in for evidence, sir. This could be good for our case. I think we're done here, Cooper. You stay here and check if you can find anything else. We'll head back to the station and analyse the evidence. So, I have the evidence. This is in the machine. So as you said, there are strangling marks here and here, and over here I have noticed no evidence of blood. Yeah, I know that. What do you mean, though? There was no blood on the victim. How could it be hit on the head with that rock? Are you sure the rock was used? The rock does have blood on it. It was definitely used to knock somebody down. But the victim was strangled. I have a feeling that wasn't the victim. What are you saying? The actual murder victim must have been elsewhere. That was the killer. We better get to the crime scene quick before something bad happens. We've got the body, son. Scientists been murdered. What do we do? 